Let's talk a little more recruiting here, and we will dive into Ohio State. And yes, uh, a lot of people want to poke fun at the being trademarked. They finally got that deal done. I don't want to dive in the weeds on that, and I don't feel like you guys do either. So we'll skip that. Ohio State got three top 50 wide receivers to commit to them between Monday and Wednesday. Monday, they got a five-star. Tuesday, they got a five-star. Wednesday, they got a four-star, but he was still a top 50 recruit. These guys are ridiculous. Uh, five-star Carnell Tate on Monday, and then five-star Brandon Ennis on Tuesday, four-star Noah Rogers on Wednesday. I Brian Hartline is a magician, an absolute magician. I don't know what else to say about him. I mean, he is... A, what direction does he go? Does he become an offensive coordinator? Does he become, uh, some, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm just wondering what his next step is. Does he just hang out at Ohio State forever? Like, the same way we were talking about Sark with, you know, first-round quarterbacks, with all the stuff that he did at USC with Mark Sanchez, et cetera, uh, uh, Carson Palmer, all that. We could say the same thing about Brian Hartline at Ohio State and, and what Ryan Day is doing. I mean, you look at the... Just in the past five to six years, the wide receiver recruits that have come out of Ohio State that have gone into the NFL, that's the easiest sell in the world. You don't have to worry with NIL and all that. Like it, Those guys know, if I go to this school, I'm going to get drafted. That's an easy sell. With this, I'm, I don't know what Heartline does next. right? I think, I think he ends up becoming a head coach somewhere soon. Uh, somewhere in the max, somewhere close, etc. cetera. I, we'll see. We'll see. But this is this is just ridiculous. Uh, Brandon Ennis, Carnell Tate, both five-star guys in the same class. Just, whew, this is a lot. This is a lot for sure. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at Chris B. Giannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.